Whoa! I was both intrigued and surprised that I am surrounded by a lot of my siblings. I have like like roughly a hundred siblings. Yeah, that's right. Roughly a hundred siblings. I was very, very shocked. What I mean by roughly a hundred is that I mean um, over a hundred. A hundred and eight. 117 120 I don't even know but I know but I just know this I don't have I do not have no more than within a hundred siblings in the 100s I know for sure that I do not have two seven nine or or even 1,000 siblings you know, I, I knew that I have over one just that one single hundred there was a lot of them I am um, I am the youngest of uh, over a hundred, and I'm the oldest of obviously, and I'm the oldest of obviously a few. I'm oldest of obviously a few because there's a because I see some a few little Smurfs that look like they're children. Whoa. I'm not gonna divulge it to the name because it's too long, so I'm gonna skip to the next part. After the Smurfs introduced myself, I realized what each of these Smurfs looked like. So you're all named after your personalities, I asked. You don't, don't you get any names you're born? It's the Smurf thing, responded um, uh, Papa. Yeah, I just know I just know one thing that Piccolo is not a personality. It's the name. It's the name of a musical instrument, said Hefty. Well, th th that's all I can. Th that's all I. All I know. All I know is my name is uh, Piccolo. I I re I replied. Uh, hmm. Papa Smurf was trying to absorb my special talent, uh, trying to give me a better name than just Piccolo. Uh, but the Smurf way. Oh, you'll stay here for now, on, uh, young Smurf. Uh, he said. You're surrounded by those who love and care about you. And then and then I reply, well, it's a good thing you agreed to adopt me, Papa Smurf, because um, I'm 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 a I'm a I'm a runaway orphan. The other Smurfs were shocked at what they hear me say. You're an orphan. Oh, my. Uh, said Smurfette in a shocked voice. You're an orphan. Nobody wants to adopt me. It's been it's been a long, long time. No one wants to adopt someone as old as me. <sighs> I sighed in sadness. So I decided to continue my fortune. Um, I'll find my fortune without a family. But here I am in this village. I stated. Oh well, well you're welcome here. Said, uh, said, um, Handy Smurf. All the Smurfs were thriving at happiness to see that there is a new Smurf. They start singing this song La 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 For some reason, I find that as a very catchy tune. So here's what I did. I pulled out my phone and I used my voice recorder app that I downloaded. And I used the audio to record it. Then when the recording is done, I put the phone back into my pocket. We're going to build you one amazing house, said Handy. So I kind of need, so, um, we're going to build some house. Thank you, Handy, I said. Hmm. I looked around and, and I saw that all the Smurf houses were mushrooms. You're going to build me a mushroom house, I asked. Of course, all Smurfs live in mushroom houses, he, uh, he replied. Then, um, the little, uh, second female Smurf named Sasset, uh, ran up to me and started hugging me and said, Oh, I can't believe it. I have a, I have a new big brother. Hmm. I'm so happy. 
that that I have that I have another big brother. She she was hugging me. When she was hugging me, it it, it filled me with a lot of uh, happiness. A little, my heart started beating. I was being hugged by a young female Smurf. It's like having a it's like having a a baby sister. I uh, I closed my eyes and I hugged back. Aww, said said the said the other Smurfs. I never I never felt so loved in my life. Oh, mm, she's hugging me. It's like having it's like having a sister. I I I I I feel I never felt loved in my life. So this is what it feels like to have a baby sister. But I've killed them all and I'll get these ones. And she called me, she called me, uh, she called me Big Brother, bruh. I, 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 I feel great. Wow. I'm so happy to have a family. I'm so happy to, uh, have a family. Uh, After the hug, Handy uh, uh, directed me towards an empty spot here in the Smurf Village. All right, Piccolo, um, come forward, please. He says. Brain, Brainy Smurf, uh, Brainy Smurf walked in and said, "You should build our new Smurf a special house, uh, a very special house, because uh, Papa Smurf that says that every Smurf needs a house." Brainy went on and on talking. That's right. Papa Smurf is always right. And you know that I'm the most educated Smurf in the entire... Before Brainy could finish his sentence, Brainy got got uh, got kicked up in the air. And uh, and he fell down at the edge of the bush. Mm. <sighs> I'm just trying to teach you how to treat our new friend. Uh, our new addition to the Smurf family. On with um Handy. Handy Smurf says, "Okay, I just need to. I just need to have the right blueprints to build you a house." Mm. I ain't got a but then I realized. But then I realized that what was going on. You're giving me my own house. I asked. Of course. Every Smurf needs their privacy. But so you don't live in the same house as your your your, your parents. No, no, silly. What do you, uh, what do you think being a Smurf is? Yelled Grouchy. I'm still dumbfounded that we found a random Smurf that's other than us. Yelled Grouchy. I hate surprises. Don't be, don't be rude, Grouchy. Said Smurfette. He, he is new around here. Maybe he's just a little confused. She added, Hmm, I hate confusion, said Grouchy. Oh, don't mind him, said Handy. He hates a lot of stuff. That's why we call him Grouchy Smurf. Huh, I, I replied quietly. Okay, let's get started on your house. But then I realized that, uh, that around here, there's no electricity to power my games. So, uh, I so what I did is I pulled out a bunch of spare wires and I said, "Hey, Handy, when you build my house, um, can you uh put this inside my house?" What, what is that? Said uh, Handy. Oh, those are wires. They're called wires. Uh, I I stick I stick these inside my house. Huh? The other Smurfs were puzzled. How strange. What is it for? Decorations or something? Whispered one Smurf. Oh, oh, they look like snakes, said Scaredy Smurf. So, uh, Handy got started on building my house. And in the process, uh, he's, um, um, he's using, um, he's using some, uh, w some of the wires that I've given him. I don't understand why Piccolo wants me to put these in with inside his house, uh, but it's what he wants. Uh. And then I pull, and then I pulled out a small little box. It was a spare. It was a spare circuit breaker. Uh. Okay, Handy, 
Now what I want you to do is put these uh, wires inside this thing. Uh, Pandy was confused. He pulled out the loose circuit. He grabbed the loose circuit breaker and put it in inside it. Uh, he put all, he connected all the wires inside it. Uh, but then something happened. Zzz, whoa! Said Handy. It seems that the circuit breaker merged with the uh with the wires seems to be creating the what the Smurfs do not have, electricity. Yeah. Whoa! Oh my Smurf! He 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 said in shock. Whoa! Okay, now build the um the the walls and stuff. Handy started uh, building the walls and building, building and building and building and building. Leave one hole and make it square. I ordered. Yeah, I think it's just normal, bro. Handy was puzzled. What are you making me do to your house? Oh, it's something that you wouldn't understand. It 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 it, it helps me with some stuff. Handy was still puzzled. Now put this inside the square. Handy, uh, put the, uh, put the put the 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 plug transformer inside of it, and then he attached it inside of the square hole. All right. Now now make it into now keep building it to more square holes, and I want you to put about eight more. Okay, you're the boss, he says. He put in, he, he filled in each square hole that I purposely have him leave. And all of the plug transformers were in. They were all in. But the, everything was being built, but there was one thing that was left. And the one thing that was left was where, where the, where the uh, chandelier goes. I pulled out a spare chandelier. The other Smurfs were surprised at how pretty it was. It was full of it was full of some jewels. Ooh, ooh, said the other Smurfs. My, my, what is that you got there? Said Vanity Smurf as he looked at his mirror. Hmm, I can even see myself on it. What is that? Some kind of mirror trinket? I replied to him. It's called a chandelier, Vanity. I, I use it to make my house look pretty. Yeah. All right, I want you to connect this to the wires. Huh? I said to Handy. Uh, okay. Yeah. What kind of house is he having him build? Axe Hefty. Yeah. I, I don't know, said Clumsy. Yeah. So, well, Handy attached the wires that's up on the chandelier. Everything was perfect. Huh? Now this last thing I did was myself. I put up a magnetic thermostat. A one in two hundred rarity. It was it was all ready to power it up. Then I wired it myself. And then I put in up a number. The Smurfs were puzzled. Oh, uh, what is that? Said Clumsy. Oh, this thing. Oh, it's called a therm. It's called a thermostat. I, I answered. Ooh, the Smurfs are fascinated. Ooh, how does it work? Well, it determines the temperature of my house. We see. I I I start touching the thermostat. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You see. Oh. It's you see, no, when the number goes up, the the um oh, the the temperature of this uh, house gets I hot. I turned on the thermostat with the switch. And here it was, started feeling hot. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. It started feeling hot. Smurfy Smurf. It is hot in here, bro. It's very hot, says, um, uh, says uh, Vanity as he fans himself with the use of his mirror. Whew, it's very hot. It's very hot, said Handy. Handy then took took off his hat uh, and start fanning himself with it. It won't be hot for long, I said. I start touching the thermostat again, uh, and it start with a very lower temperature. Uh, then again, it went from hot, from spoiling hot, to freezing cold. 
the, the Smurfs beginning to shiver a little. The cold was accumulating and emanating through the village. Huh? Ooh. Oh my, it's Smurfly cold, said, uh, said Smurf Hat. Papa Smurf then walks in and said, Oof, it's cold already, but, but, but it's sunny. How could it be cold? It's cold as it is, it's snowing. Oh, sorry, Papa Smurf, I said. I turned the thermostat off and the temperature reverted back to normal. The cold air was gone. It evaporated. Ugh. It was cold for a second, yeah, but it's not cold anymore. Uh, oh, sorry, Papa Smurf. That came from my house. You see, um, you see, I have a, I have a small little machine that controls the temperature of my house. It's called, it's called a thermostat. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. showed it to Papa Smurf, and uh, I showed him what I showed the other Smurfs. Very fascinating. Handy Smurf looked at it and he was shocked. Wow, Piccolo, did you in did you invent this? He asked me, and I said, "Well, no. Well, I, I know it's being used by a lot where I come from, but they use it for comfort, you know, to help people relax because of the temperature." So, this is very fascinating," said Handy. Yeah. Wait a second, these wire things, is it powering this thing? I, I replied, yes, it's powering this thing. Whoa, whoa, that is a unique, that is a unique machine, he asked. Whoa, wow, 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 wow. All right, my Smurfs, let's get back to work. All the Smurfs am scrape together. All the Smurfs amp scrape together as they get on back to I work. I ask, can I help? He asks. Oh no, no, you're new. We'll let you have the first day, but tomorrow you'll start working. I said, understood, Papa Smurf. While the other Smurfs work, with all the plugs in, I pulled out my TV, my games, my heater, my computer, including the bathroom. I, I, I pulled out everything. I pulled out everything and all my TV and stuff was connected. Then I start, I start, I start pressing the button on my TV with the use of my TV remote. And guess what? TV was playing. It was it was a commercial for Red Lobster. Mmm. The Red Lobster food is still good since I left town. Yeah. I started looking at uh, commercials and stuff, and a, and a few of my favorite shows. I turned every channel. I, and then I watched some some Teen Titans go, and I watched even more of my shows. But then um, um but then one Smurf walked in. It was um, it was Handy Smurf. Piccolo, what was that noise I heard? I hear voices around here. Are you all right? And I said. I'm 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 fine, Handy. I'm fine. Okay. Well, back to work. Yeah, it's not a surprise. The Smurfs don't know about television yet. I was willing. I would be willing to show them that, but not right now. So what I did is I don't want to alarm the Smurfs. So I start playing games. Playing games on my computer. Bruh. Yeah, games on my computer. That's what I started doing. It was it was the break. But then I realized something. I have homework to do for over the break. It was a 200 page essay on what the things that you did over the break. I remember that I haven't done that. So what I did is I got on my computer and I started typing. Do you think I'll be able to make it to school like this? Why well, the case I cannot fail?
Even though I'm a smurf now, I gotta attend school like a normal teenager. I'm sure my, I'm, my classmates and teachers will not understand, but I need to attend school, human or not human. I'm still a student at that school. Yeah. <clears throat>